Hey guys, Todd Helms with Eastman's Hunting Journals out here today to bring you a gear review on the Leupold VX5 HD 3 to 15 by 44 CDS ZL2 with the Fire Dot Duplex reticle. I think you're going to be as impressed as I am when you watch this whole gear review. But until then, drop down, mash that subscribe button, flip on your notifications so you get notified every time we drop awesome content like this. Perfect. So, first blush after shooting this um, and using this scope, it performed flawlessly. I'm gonna talk about the CDS ZL2 dial first. I was able to make adjustments both up and down in MOA adjustment to varying targets and the scope responded exactly the way it was supposed to. All right, so we are prone. I have another rock next to a snow patch. That's 346 yards away. My come up for that is 3.64. So I'm gonna split the distance, the difference, and go to 3.50 on my come up on my dial. We'll see if the scope makes the adjustment. I'm pretty sure the rifle can do it, and I think the scope can do it too. We're gonna see if I can do it. Here we go. There's three, two, five, there's half. Fire in the hole. smoked it. I didn't have any misses because the scope didn't respond. The only miss that I had was my own fault. I kind of drifted off target a little bit on my farthest shot here in the field. Not the scope's fault. Ooh, I was a little high. That's it. I'm out. So, I missed the last one, but only by about that much. I was just over the top. So the CDS ZL2 dial, guys, you get a free dial that you can have custom made when you get this scope, but I prefer to stick with the MOA version in case I need to switch loads or whatever. You know, in today's world, ammo availability is still kind of an issue, so it's nice to be able to just run new dope and have an MOA dial. That's just me though. That's the way I like to roll. The, one of the coolest things about this is the zero lock technology. It's, technically it's zero lock two. They've made some upgrades to it and it, it performs flawlessly. On this model, I have two full rotations of elevation adjustment. I also have a capped windage right here and you're, you, you can adjust wind on this, but it's more or less designed to set it and forget it. And that's okay. I like that because the fewer knobs I have on a hunting scope, in my opinion, the better. There's less that can go wrong. The real winner on this Leupold VX5 HD 3 to 15 by 44 CDS ZL2 is the Fire Dot Duplex Reticle. Smoked it. Guys, I'm loving the Fire Dot Duplex too, by the way. Even in the bright light like this, it gives me an exact, very precise point of aim. I wasn't sure I would like the illuminated reticle. Once I got the scope set up on the rifle and got it where I wanted it to be, I turned that reticle on and it never, I, I never turned it off. Now the motion activation system uh, that's built into this scope clipped it on whenever I would pick the rifle up because I had it switched on, that little fire dot would flip on, which is awesome because in a hunting scenario, I wanna be able to turn it on and forget that it's on. I really liked how the point of impact, the point of aim was just intuitive with that little red dot glowing in the middle of that scope. It just drew my eye to where I needed to aim. And just, man, just intuitive. It makes using the scope all that much easier. And it's making, I could see in a hunting situation where my eye is gonna be drawn right to where I need to hit that animal with that fire dot reticle. I liked how I could make it brighter or dimmer. I had it turned up really, really bright and it was kind of washing out my aiming point. I didn't like that. So I hit it, turned it down a couple of times and it's really simple to do that. All you gotta do is on this side where your parallax adjustment dial is, you just press the button. You can keep pressing it and it'll go up and down, up and down. At its highest magnification, it'll go bink, bink, bink and blink at you and it doesn't get any, doesn't get any brighter. It goes lower from there. This model 
is the VX, like all the VX5 HDs, is a five to one zoom. In other words, I start on three power and I can zoom this all the way up to 15, five times magnification. I like the three to 15 magnification. Three power's not too much magnification at close range. I haven't ever wished that I had less magnification in a hunting situation, especially in the West. You get into black timber, you get into close quarters in a river bottom or something, I dial it right down to three because three is enough to make me allow me to see what I'm shooting at, but not so much that it blows up the target right in my face and I can't pick out where I want to aim. 15 power is perfect in my opinion for hunting at extended range. Anything from anytime I'm out past 300 yards out to my the end of my effective range at about 556, I'm going to have that thing set on 15. Smoked it. So one of my favorite things about the VX5 HD is the HD glass. It's, this is HD high definition glass and it just, it's crisp, it's bright, high light transmission. There's no fuzzy blurry edges, it's just crisp edge to edge. It works just flawlessly. Awesome, awesome picture. Add to that the Guard Ion or Guardion coating that Leupold built, puts on their glass. That's going to shed water, that's going to repel dust and dirt for you. You're not going to be having to clean your rifle scope all the time. And even if you do, blow it off real quick, wipe it down with, with an optical cloth, and that guard ion protection on there is going to keep it from scratching. So the MST in the scope is motion sensor technology, and that's what allows the scope to turn on and off by itself. Round all that out with fog proof, waterproof, just hard rock, tough as nails capability and durability, not to mention an awesome warranty. And you've got a winner in the Leupold VX5 HD 3 to 15 by 44 CDS ZL2. For what this scope is offering you, a sub 20 ounce weight is phenomenal. That is packing a lot of technology and a lot of capability into a very lightweight, user-friendly, streamlined package. So Leupold claims that the VX5 HD 3 to 15 by 44 CDS ZL2 scope is the lightest, most rugged 5 to 1 zoom in its class. And it is light, I gotta say that, and it is tough. I haven't dropped it. I try not to drop my hunting rifles with optics on them try to baby this thing, but it's nice to know that on rough backcountry, rough and tumble hunts in Alaska, in Wyoming, out west, wherever you might be, this scope has your back and it's going to perform every single time that you need it to. So guys, that is my gear review of the Leupold VX5 HD 3 to 15 by 44 CDS ZL2 rifle scope with the fire dot illuminated duplex reticle. Thanks for joining us out here on this review. Until next time, we'll see you in the field.